So there's a brand new huge win, in fact, for parents' rights in Virginia. So students were changing their pronouns at schools, deciding that they were transgender, and the schools were allowing all of this to happen behind the backs of parents. But now Virginia schools have totally changed those policies, and now the parents must be informed and sign off on any of those changes. Mm -hmm. Madeline Hubbard from Just the News wrote that story. She joins us now. Madeline, great to see you. I was glad to finally see a win for parents for once because these seem to be few and far between and we love to bring our audience good news on Friday. Tell us how this happened in Virginia. So if you remember, Virginia is the site of the horrific incident where the transgender biological male to female dressed as a woman went into the girl's bathroom and committed two sexual assaults. And that was a driving factor in Governor Glenn Youngkin's campaign. Now, one of the things that he campaigned on was giving parents the right to choose for their children how they should identify and keep them I, I, informed about all of this. So basically, parents must give written permission for students to change their name from what it is written on their birth certificate, as well as changing their hormones, sorry, their pronouns in class. So it's a big win for parents because it keeps them involved in that process. And it also keeps parents aware of if their students are, sorry, their children are speaking with guidance counselors about you know these different things of their gender and their sexuality. So it's a really big win for parents who want to be involved in their kids' education.